today i'm going to show you how to ingest data into the azure sql database using sql server management studio let's get started i'm going to come to this demo sales database so click on that and then i can for now click on the query editor and i want to see the table in my database so I'm going to go on and log in with my credentials and click OK. I'm going to click on these tables and expand. So I've got F transaction table. I can go on and just write a simple select top five star from the F transaction table. And then I can go on and run the query. So this is going to return the top five records from the F transaction table. We're going to go to the SQL Server Management Studio. In the SQL Server, I want to click on the Connect in the Object Explorer and choose Database Engine. In the Database Engine, I'm going to provide my server name, easily get that information by coming back to the overview in the Microsoft Azure. I'm going to, for now, click OK to unsave that. And then in the overview, I can see my server name displayed at the top here. So just go ahead and copy. And of course, to successfully connect to the SQL Server Management Studio, it is important to set the firewall. So click on the Set Server Firewall. And then you want to scroll down. And then it is essential you click on Add Your Client IP for Address. And then once you do that, go ahead and save at the bottom. Then you should be able to log in properly into the SQL Server Management Studio. So I'm going to come back here and then I've got my server name. And of course, for the authentication, I specify the SQL Server authentication. And then for my login, I've got my name and my password and click on connect. I'm successfully connected to the server. So I'm going to click on the databases plus sign to expand. And then I'm going to see the demo sales database. So I'm going to expand and of course I'm going to come to the table and then we should be able to see the F transaction table we saw earlier in the Azure SQL database. Okay, so we have the database owner F transaction. So we want to go on and ingest this dimension tables. I've got lots of them in the CSV file. And then I'm going to go back to the SSMS and then I'm going to right click on the demo sales database and select task. And they want to point to import data. For the data source, I'm going to click on this drop down and I'm going to scroll down. I want to access the Microsoft Excel and then I can go on and browse through the Excel file path. Click on. And then we have the Excel version. So the first row has column names. So click on next. And I want to choose the destination. Now I'm going to click on this drop down and I want to point to the Microsoft OLE database provider for SQL. Click on that. For the authentication, I'm going to click on this use SQL server authentication. And then for the username, I'm going to type my username. And then I'm going to type my password. And then, of course, we have the demo sales database selected automatically. Now I can go on and click on next. And then we have this copy data from one or more tables of views. So click on next. And then we can see all the worksheets. I can select the DIM account manager category and so on downwards and then click on next. So we can go on and run immediately in the save and run package. So click on next. And then we have the complete wizard finished to perform the following operations or actions click on finish go so we can see that the data is being ingested into my demo sales database okay so there we go we can see status success and then i can click on close to close the window i can right click and refresh the database so right click and choose refresh so we should be able to see all the dimension tables in the demo sales database so click on the tables and there we go so we can see all the dimension table i can right click on account manager and select the top 1000 rows okay so this is working pretty fine now i want to go back to the azure sql database and then i want to click on or go back to the 
SQL databases in the left panel and choose the demo sales database. And they want to click on the query editor, click on that. And they want to sign in using my authentication SQL server. And then when I come to the tables, I can see all the dimension tables. And of course, I can just query one of them. So let's select star from the account managers table. And then we can go on and run the query. Okay, there we go. So this is basically how we can use the SQL Server Management Studio to ingest data into the Azure SQL database. I trust you enjoyed this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up, share it to friends, and comment. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.